So we are at uh, Dainichi and Hoshikin, they're located in the same, uh, same area. Um, in the area Niigata, there are about 55,000 of those vending machines. You can find them everywhere. But what about this design? Who would love to have one like this? Would it be sponsored? No, yeah, maybe by the uh, local government. So you can get hot coffee out of this one. You can get cold drinks. And it's, it's working very easy. You can even pay with bills. So um, let's continue. We're at the Danichi Koi Farm. I'm with Howard. We uh, left Domi and Johan back at Terrazzo. And they are still busy. They're still working. It's getting dark, but um, we can check it out. Yeah, so first clean the shoes. As you can see, they're packaging the koi. <laughs> so the shipping continues every single day. So, fish goes in here, they weigh the box with water. So it's now 22 kilos, oh, sorry, <laughs> 22 up. So the box is 23 kilos and um, they're gonna pack it up. They even put a poster in their bags, special make. Seventy kilos. And they're ready for transport. Twenty five. <laughs> really good. <laughs> Check the ball over here. So they put the, put the koi in sleep. That's good for their um, condition. So they're not dead, but they, um, as you can see, they can breathe really good. So that's it, that's how they uh, ship koi and they fill it up with air, they put an extra bag in it and um, from there on uh, it's ready, uh, ready to go. Let me look, this shipment goes to, I can't read it because it's in Japanese. but. This is how they ship uh, koi from a koi farm for the people. Uh. So they just packed all the koi and it's directly going on transport. As you can see, it's uh, shipped in a good way. There it goes, off to the airport directly. 
So that's what we call time management here at Danichi Koi Farm. There he goes. Off to a new customer, a new owner or a new dealer. So we're still at the Danichi Koi Farm and um, they are uh, harvesting, I think it's Tosai, and they're even doing the Senbetsu. Senbetsu means they are, uh, oh there it is, it's on Tosai. They are selecting the good from the bad ones, quality wise. It's getting a little bit dark, but they're still working here at the uh, Danichi Koi Farm. So as you can see, they got one side probably with Tadogoi and the other side with Koi that's ready to, um, to get used. The keepers. It's quite special to see, I've never watched it. So the master himself is selecting Koi. He puts the Jinrin Tansha show us out first. Then he counts them. How much the um, So this is the second round. He emptied his, his bag and now he's busy with the second round of those koi. And these are his top koi. He seduced them so you can watch them a little bit closer. Really interesting. I tried to figure out what he's exactly doing, but of course this is the second round of checking his category. And I think these are the, the keepers. So he puts them in the net. they can recover and they will do very quickly some of the tensions are already swimming again so that's cool from there on the process starts again So he first picks out the keepers, the Tata core, then he uses the sort out the guy, the one he wants to take and the one he throws away. Or get killed. This is a really it takes a lot of time to do this.
they took out all the koi and they are waiting to get to be filmed by one of his crew.